Continuing team coverage now in Pickens County where voters have the big decision to make on Tuesday. They get to choose whether or not to have alcohol sales on Sundays. 7 News' is Sophia Radebaugh spoke to two council members with different opinions on this issue. Several cities across Pickens County still don't allow alcohol sales on Sundays. Pickens County is one of the last counties in South Carolina that hasn't voted this in. But Tuesday's election could change that. If you want a margarita or beer on a Sunday at Fiesta Restaurant in Liberty. We have a lot of people who come in from like out of town. You'll have to wait. They're really shocked when they come in here and they ask us, you know, for alcohol and we tell them that we can't sell it in this county. Liberty is one of the cities in Pickens County that still doesn't allow alcohol sales on Sundays. It definitely affects um, how much money we're able to make because we definitely could make a lot more money and bring in a lot more business if we were able to. But on Tuesday, voters will okay. have the chance to change that law countywide. Uh, to make a change like this, you need to let local governments and, and local folks, you know, pick for themselves. Earlier this year, Pickens County Council voted to put two Sunday alcohol sales referendums on the ballot. The questions on the ballot ask whether to allow the sale of beer and wine on Sundays at approved places like convenience stores or grocery stores, and if alcoholic beverages can be sold at approved businesses like restaurants and bars. Alex Seda represents District 3 in Pickens County and says he thinks the referendum shouldn't even be on the ballot. I just don't think making intoxicants, whether it's alcohol or marijuana or the craze we had with prescription painkillers years ago, more accessible to the public. But Henry Wilson, who represents folks, you know, District 6, so. disagrees. You know, it's kind of nice that the local government can set individual, you know, ego and attitude and personalities aside and kind of put things on the ballot so the individual people can pick what they want. Some cities in Pickens County, like Central, Clemson, Easley, and Pickens, created a separate ordinance to allow alcohol sales on Sundays. This vote will not affect them. In Pickens County, Sophia Radeball, 7 News. If you live in Pickens County and you're registered to vote, you can view the Pickens County sample ballot online. We have a link on our website, WSPA.com.